hello guys welcome to the service now what and today we'll see how to send record link in email notification in service now so many times we get a requirement from a client like uh, when we want to send a mail from service now we have to attach a record links so it will be like uh, we, they, we have to send one mail from service now in the email body we have to give the link of the record and when a user click on that link it will open the relevant record for that so like that we are getting so uh, how we do this kind of requirement that we'll see today so for implementing this we'll take one use case today and the use case is like we have to send an email notification with incident record link when a new incident record get created and the additional requirement like when a user clicks on that link it will open relevant record so basically what we need to do like uh, when the new incident got created we have to send one email notification to the caller okay and what what we need to do like in email body we have to give the link of the incident record as well so whenever the user clicks on that link it will open the that that particular incident record for whom that incident uh, for in, uh, non, non notification got triggered so how we'll do that let we'll see today so let's go to the instance and try to implement it so now we are in an instance and let's open the incident table first So basically the requirement like when we create a new record new record or incident record then we have to trigger the notification right so let's let me open one duplicate tab here and here i'll search notification then we click on new yes so now the new record for the notification got opened so here we just configured our notification so i'll just give here the name so i'll just give demo incident link and i'll select the table that is incident and i'll just keep category as uncategorized only and here I'll just check the option inserted and here I'll put the condition I'll put the condition like incident state is new now we'll go to this who will receive tab and there I'll just uh, add because I want to send this a notification to the caller so i'll just select caller here and i'll just keep myself as well like as logged in as a system administrator so that also i'll add it and here i'll just in this tab i'll just give the subject so like uh, i'll just add one i'll just take anything like uh, demo of incident record link and here i'll write hi and i'll just take caller first name And here I'll write thank you for contacting service desk. Our service desk representative 
will contact you soon and here i have to give the link of the incident record so i'll just give right click here to view incident record and for giving the link we are getting one out of the box from starting so that is we'll write dollar inside curly bracket we'll write uri ref and then after that i'll enter and write regards service desk t so what uri ref will do it will show the link in the mail body of uh, the record okay so let's save it and test it yes so what i'll do i'll just came here i'll just refresh this page one more time and i'll just create a new incident here We'll select our user enable tutor and put the description like test short description and I'll just save it now we'll just go to the sys email table and check the email logs whether mail has been triggered or not so I'll just write sys email dot list okay and I'll just take the subject from here so this is our subject so I'll just give the filter here subject starts with and you see that one email got triggered right so let me open this email just click on preview email And you see that like it's coming as a link and when we click on this link it will open the record which have got created so we have created this record if you see here the incident one triple zero two that incident one triple zero two got opened so like that we can attach the link in the email body so sometimes like uh, in an interview also you will get a question like that like uh, how will attach the record link in an email body so you can just say you are if you can use a uri ref parameter or something like uh, variable so that is coming as out of the box but if you see here one thing like we are getting the incident number sometimes they are saying i don't want to show the incident number in the mail body what to do so for that you what you need to do you just simply remove this underscore ref so what will happen after this like a link will come but it there in uh, that uh, display value of the record will not show so let me show you here i'll just save it i'll just go one step back here And I'll just create one more incident. I'll just take test two. I'll just save it. 
and let me refresh this page just wait for some time yes if you see here this one is the this one is the new mail and if you see if we click on preview email we are seeing that now it's coming as a link it's not showing the display value of the record okay previously in the link it's a display value of the record it's coming right so like display value in incident form is the number field that's why their value is coming if we click on in this link that will also redirect, redirect to the record but it will not show any record number or the display value field in the email body so both the things we can use whether we can use uri or we can use the uri ref so uri like if you don't want to show the display value uh, of the record okay or uh, if you if you want to show the display value of the record maybe number or any of the field then we'll use the dollar uri ref so i hope you got it and if you have any doubt please write in the comment box Till that time, thank you, God bless you all.